16th of December to 14th, 15th of January is Margali, till 14th is Margali. So the month of Margali is coming, 16th of December to 14th, 15th of January is Margali, till 14th is Margali. What this means is, in terms of inertia in the northern hemisphere of the planet, this is a month where the inertia is at its highest. That means, you tend to become like that. Unknowingly, everything slows down. Physical body tries to slow down. Uh, we must make sure we're active, otherwise body slowing down is not just about the body, it'll also suck the mind into it and make it a little depressive. It is recorded everywhere in the world, then during the winter months, the volume of psychological depressive conditions are multiply. I don't know the stats, but they multiply. Because naturally, there may be other aspects, their social activities and other things have come down. Those are also there. But it's a fact, well established, that if you sprout a seed in the month of March, how it'll sprout? If you try to sprout the same seed in this Margali between December and January, how it'll sprout, there is a difference. It's because of this, in southern India, it was almost like banned. A woman should never conceive in this month. If she conceives in this month, it could be not so developed kind of baby coming out, you know? I didn't point at anybody <laughs> So a lot of precautions being taken to see that a woman does not conceive in this month because what sprouts in this month will not be of the best quality. There are stories in the tradition which says uh, during Margali month you don't do anything auspicious, women should not conceive, all kinds of things. And they say, at this time certain spirits will come upon you and you will become dumb. So you should not do any business deals, any auspicious things you should not do because you will do a stupid deal. So when things are slowing down like this, it's good to do certain things. This is why you started lighting the lamps all over the place. Because lamp light, fire, energy makes some difference. Today you may not understand the difference because everywhere electric lights are on and you visually don't feel it and essentially you are uh, nearly seventy percent or more totally visually dependent on perception. Hmm?